you know why. Make sure you don't forget why you're here tonight and what you need and what you want from this show is yours. This show tonight is for you. So please, if you want to dance, cry, laugh, take selfies, give me the side eye every night, all the time because you don't actually love what I do, you're just here to be a hater. Bring it, let's go. Woo! Rule number two, please be kind to your neighbor and have fun. Rule number three, don't watch the whole show through your phone, lady. I want to see your face, not your phone. It looks like I'm landing a small plane. How are you? Trust me, you'll remember it better in the moment. Yeah. This is going to be crazy sound with loads of bass. It's nice to meet you. I love your whole outfit. Everything is happening. Everything is great. Where are we, number four? Four, number four. Number if you don't know the words to the song, do not sing them. <laughs> I do not have time to be making eye contact with someone that thinks they know the words, and they don't, and then I start singing what you're singing. And there's someone here at the front that is zoomed into my face, filming me sing the wrong words. Don't fuck me up. You came here to believe in me. <laughs> I believe in you too. Woo! Okay, the last rule. If you can't sing... Shut up! Shut up. Woo! Just keep it low, you know? Just keep it low. I'm joking, guys. You can sing as loud as you want. But if I come near you and you guys are singing loud and I put my in-ear back in, just know. Just know it wasn't your calling. Okay? I want you guys to enjoy this show. I want you to feel it. I want you to love it. I want you to understand that I'm going to try and get to know you guys as much as I can. And if I make eye contact with you, please don't look away. Stand back at me. I need you. So I want to tell you guys a quick story about me. When I was nine years old, I was running through the park with my dad and my sisters, and I collapsed. And um, I stopped reading, my dad picked me up, we went to the hospital and I was diagnosed with a heart disease um, called Wolf Parkinson White Syndrome. If anyone here has anything similar, you understand, it's not easy in these streets, but we're trying. You know, and that's all we can do. And my whole life I was in and out of hospital and it's funny because I recently realised something so powerful and it actually it was literally a few days ago and I realized that sometimes when we're told something that we don't want, we see it as a weakness. But the, but the moments that I was made to fight from very young to now have enabled me to be the woman I am right now. And have actually, have actually saved me from being able to go down a path that I can't go down and don't want to go down. You know, in this industry, this, in life. But the darkness is always there, like, yo, okay. you know? And this song that I wrote was a moment where I had to remind myself that you have to move at your own pace in life. You can't go on her or him or them or the, anyone else but yourself. In grief, in love, in a new house, a new job, you have to go at your own pace and be gentle with yourself. And I had to really learn that a hard way. And when I stopped making music, I was like, I need a break. And as soon as I started again, it was, we can do this, we can do this, we can do this, we can do this. And I had a huge argument with my manager and said, go easy on me. And I went to the studio and I wrote this song. And it's a reminder to myself and to everyone else to be gentle. I don't care how old you are. Life throws us stuff when we least expect it. Don't ever be mad at yourself for taking a little bit more time than her or him. It's okay. And the voice that you hear at the end of this song is my granddad who died of the same heart disease I have. And he sent me the video three days before he passed away. And he was the guy that I would talk to about everything. He was an amazing jazz drummer and traveled the world. And I miss him so much. So I play these words at the end of this song. Nothing more than he speaks wisdom, and when someone speaks of wisdom, you share it. So, 
I'm not gonna talk anymore, I'm gonna sing now. But Los Angeles, if you know the words, sing along, and if you don't. <laughs> Oh, it's worth it.